Hey Pisces, how are you doing today? We're just doing your May 2023 reading today. Let's see what we got for Pisces, the fishies. We got for Pisces for your May 2023 reading. Okay, first off, right off the bat, we've got the full card in reverse. You may have wanting to, um, may have been wanting to go somewhere, and somebody maybe venture off to somewhere new. Maybe you were starting something, um, or trying to um, start your own path. And then somebody came in and kind of um, said, hey, please don't go right now. Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Can we clarify more on the full? Then we have the Seven of Wands. Yeah, I get that somebody was trying to work on something um, to do with themselves. And maybe somebody else wasn't um, getting out of the way for them to go do this. It seems that they're really wanting to um, go venture off and find themselves. And then we got the Four of Swords. You could um, have been worried about something or a situation but I don't see you worried about that anymore it might have to do with this wanting to uh, either move away or go somewhere new or kind of frolic off into the distance you don't really seem to be worried about what other people think and then we've got the chariot in reverse yeah, you were supposed to make a decision about where you were going to go. And you um, stopped. I don't know if you care what other people think or not, Pisces. But if you do, um, this may be stopping you from going places. We've got the Hierophant here. Pisces, I feel like you... Um, are very spiritual. There might be somebody... Okay, now I know what's going on. Your parents could be very religious. And you were going somewhere. Or trying to find yourself. And it didn't involve this religion. We've got the, th uh, the Five of Pentacles in reverse here. Somebody who is on the outs for money here. You may be asking somebody for money. Is maybe your parents? Um. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I I'm kind of putting the pieces together here. You were asking for money from your parents, and your parents are very religious, and you're asking them for money. To go somewhere that they did not agree with. So now, you're not getting that money because of where you want to go. Can I clarify more on this Five of Pentacles for Pisces? We've got the Stars card here. There was a rebirth. In the reverse... You may need to be more giving towards yourself now. You may have to replenish yourself instead of maybe this higher authority figure. I'm very confused too. I feel very confused. When I start feeling things in the readings, like I just kind of say it. Um, I feel in my head, I feel like just like confused like I don't know why 
Then we've got a Knave of Cups here in the reverse. Pisces, this is you. Um, yeah, you're feeling some sort of way. So maybe somebody come out with some information about you. With this um, Knave of Cups here. Maybe you're telling somebody something. Or you stop telling them something about how you feel because they don't really want to hear it. Why is that? Be more on the Knave of Cups. The Hermit card. You can be very silent. Or very, um... Like, you like your solitude kind of person. Maybe you're not saying something to um, your parents. Because you don't want to start an argument. And just like water sign nature, you just go with the flow. About everything. Then we've got the Empress in reverse here. So, the Empress is somebody that you would look up to. But in the reverse, this could be a mother figure for you. Um, I don't know why it feels like maybe this mother figure is doesn't really understand you. And you don't understand them. And then we've got the Nine of Wands in reverse. We could be dealing with somebody. <coughs> That's tolerance for people is low. And you're somebody that likes to dedicate yourself to different um, causes. Maybe having to do with the fact that your family in general is very religious. Um, this Knight of Wands here as well is a fire sign. You may have tried to, like, like I said, been going somewhere to maybe try to help somebody or do something or find yourself. And then these... This family uh, member said something and then you didn't go. Or maybe they have control over your life without you really realizing it. And then we've got the Nine of Pentacles. So, there is definitely money here. Um... I take it that whoever this is has compassion towards others and is very kind towards others. And with that being said, maybe people donate to a cause of some sort and maybe somebody's donating money to you. And then we've got the Ten of uh, Wands here. There's somebody taking chances here, but also holding a whole lot of stuff on their shoulders. I don't know if this is you I or a family member that's holding a lot of stuff on their shoulders. And that really... Um, conflicts their mind state about who or what you are. Then we've got the Three of Swords here. This is, uh, Three has to do with communication, but with the Swords, I feel like there's also an air sign here that may have, um, hurt somebody by not communicating with them. And then we've got the Queen of Cups in reverse. 
somebody was not telling somebody how they feel about something. Maybe to do with this Queen of Cups. Could be you. Maybe somebody's not saying something to you to try to not hurt your feelings about this venture. Hmm. And then we've got the Two of Swords in reverse. This is a partnership, maybe with the air sign, that you didn't see everything very clearly with. Um, maybe they were uh, very deceitful, and they had you hoodwinked. Somebody was supposed to be loyal to somebody else, and this is supposed to be, this was maybe a long-term partnership with somebody. And they were just very deceitful. I don't know if you're still in that energy or not with this person. And then we've got the two of pentacles with juggling um, money here. You could just kind of be figuring out where to get money. Or how you're going to balance the situation. What to do with money. We've got a king of pentacles here in reverse. Somebody, a male figure, is holding on to some money maybe for you. Um, maybe you have a bank account and they're putting money in your bank account. For later use. Because they don't want you to have it right now. Then we got the two of wands. Somebody's looking outwards towards something. I feel like this is a partnership. This person's looking towards the world. Maybe they want to go somewhere. Somewhere foreign. And they kind of don't want to stay where, stay put. I don't know if this is you or not, Pisces. And then we've got the Four of Cups. You could be giving to somebody. And they don't even notice. Is what I get. You could be giving to... Um, it's like a giving tree. Can't give to trees, obviously, but this, you know what I mean. It's the giving tree. It's a book. It's like you give to somebody so much, but they don't see anything that you're doing. And it's the reason that you give to them is because you feel for them. You feel very deeply for them. Who is this person that you're giving to? We've got the Knight of Wands. We've got a relay of information information here, like a messenger of some sort. Maybe this person is coming towards you with some information about um, what they're doing right now. This could be anything, really. But definitely some sort of messenger saying something to you. Uh, giving you a relay message. Maybe from somebody else. And then we've got the King of Cups. This is a very strong male figure who's a water sign. I can sense in the background this person may um, travel quite extensively for work. This could be a father that travels for work. I don't know what kind of work he does, but it's definitely all across the world. He's traveling many places. I want to say sailor. Um, or maybe a... Uh, I just feel like this person's a humanitarian, but also like super compassionate with the people that they work with. And also just kind of tells it how it is. They're very mature. 
Um, God, what do I want? I want to say marine. I don't know. And then we've got the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody was giving money to somebody, and that was, um, they stopped doing that because they couldn't afford it. You may have a father figure who was giving you money, but now, or a husband, a father figure or a husband that was giving you money, but now they can't afford it. Maybe due, a, due to a lack of, um, hours in their job or something. And then we got a Nine of Cups in reverse. So, somebody was supposed to get something. Um, this is a success payoff here. Your father could be trying to retire, but can't due to money. Or maybe your husband is trying to retire and he can't due to money. I'm going to pull one more card on this. Uh, so, we got the Three of Cups. Somebody's celebrating something. Um... This involves the communication and growth. This man could have daughters. Maybe three. And he's celebrating with them. Maybe due to a retirement. And then we've got uh, Eight of Cups in reverse. Somebody was walking towards how they, uh, walking away from how they feel, but they're not doing that anymore. They could have been walking away from, um, I want to say material gains, but they can't do that, which uh, goes back to them not being able to do something because they can't afford it. Alright Pisces, that's all I got for you for your monthly reading. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you later.